Got me. And go ahead. Yeah, hey, yeah, yeah. One, two, one, two, one, two. One, two. Check, check. Check, check. It's going to be a real sad moment when they show you. Huh? We live. Here we are. The Portway Podcast is live. Omaha, Nebraska. Man. We've been moving now for, ooh, we've been moving now for over a year. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We've been uh, moving now for over a year. Been Coincidentally, mobile. I just just mentioning it, but it's been over a year. The first hey, time was, was Dallas. This this month will be three years on the podcast. Three, and no, September will be three years on the podcast. I thought it was August. Is it? The end of August? Uh, yeah. I, no, no, no. It's like the first or second week of September. Okay, okay, okay. Cursing, though. Yeah, shout out to he'll, Cursing. He'll, he'll clue us in. Yeah, yeah. But listen, we happy to be here. Hey, how's our audio? We good? Okay. We're going to make it work. Happy to see uh, everything that just went down in in, uh, in this parade. Man, they had some whips. Sean. Yeah, the, the old school. Hey, they had the whips, the dips. I, I, and I the, never knew you was an old school guy. I'm not, I am and I ain't. Okay, okay. I'm okay. a vintage guy. Like I love vintage stuff. Okay. It's weird, but I love vintage stuff. So, you see, I'm not. I'm not all about the old school car. I don't really ride in one myself, uh-huh. but I do like seeing them. Because I like the vintage. I like that. What it's is it? old. You, you know said you mean? was interested in getting a. Uh, I forgot what they call. But Can, the three wheel. Uh, yeah. Can, not Can Am. Not but, yeah. Uh, Polaris. Yeah, Polaris. Yeah. Shout out to Dane. Dane got a couple of those. Yeah. I've been thinking about getting one for since I ever since they, they, they jumped out. It's just the heat in Vegas. That's the only reason why I don't. Why you think I ain't got one? Yeah. yeah <laughs> why you think I ain't got one? That's the only thing. And they, they pulled up in some of them. We had some uh, go-karts. Yeah. A little bit of everything. Girls, yeah, the little kids out there breaking it down. And and then, it. and then there was Bud. Man. And, and, Man. and Shakur. Man, with the fishing poles. And, and, all of, and all of Omaha was in this parade, by hey, the way. Hey, the, the Bud said, everybody, hey, Bud, can I be in the parade? Yeah. Hey, Bud, can I be in the parade? Yeah. I it promise no, you, no. anybody that wasn't in the parade Didn't ain't happen. never shook hands with Bud. If you shook hands with Bud, you was in the parade today. No question. But that's love. That's love. Yeah. Okay, I got you. Yeah, so we're gonna keep this bad boy rolling. Uh-huh. I'm gonna be talking just to keep keep the the the, the drowning this, this the music out so that we can make this thing happen without getting any issues. Shout out to 87.9. They showed us nothing but love. They yeah. shot you out a couple. But times. we had to go now. We got to go now because we don't know how long this thing go last once yeah, Bud yeah. reaches the uh the part the stage. Yeah, once and, Bud uh, gets on there, this is going crazy. But I assure y'all, man, nothing but love down here. Everybody down here watching the podcast. Yeah. Guess what? They not watching the podcast because they enjoy the podcast. They want to see who talking shit about Bud. Hey, and and you know what? I got a little bit, but I ain't get it too much. Out of the thousands of people I met, I probably got two people. One dude called me corny. I'll take it. Uh, <laughs> one dude said, you don't know what you're talking about. Hey, I'll take he called it. you corny, I thought something was coming behind no, that. No, 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 no. I thought something was coming no, behind no, that. No, no, because what I get is they see me. And they think I'm little. I, and then they see me, and they be like, okay. But I don't know what's going to happen. I still ain't been able to put my finger on it. I don't know if one day you're going to get me in trouble or if it's still going to always be peace. Yeah. No, no, no. Come on, let's do it. Yeah. You was you was, you was was fishing with Bud? <laughs> we was all fishing. He said we was all fishing with Bud. Excuse me. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Boom. Yeah, come on. Yeah, but yeah. we're going we to keep talking, though. We got to keep talking. They got the highlights playing. Yeah. I seen one of mine. I didn't like it. Appreciate it. But it's a part of it. Hey, yeah, it's part of it. It's a part of it. You got a lot of people in your highlights. Yeah, yeah. And some of your friends. Yeah, yeah. So what do you mean I'm going to get you in trouble? I don't know if y'all don't know whether or not you're going to get me in I'm trouble. Se- I think we're separated enough that people respect you and like, here come this nigga. So they, so they're gonna say, "Watch out, Sean! Push me to yeah, the yeah, side." Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> and yeah, come yeah. after you. <laughs> See, first off, it's not Bud because I didn't never went too crazy on Bud, and they they realized. Well, you know why I get a pass? Because they realized me and Bud are actually friends. Now, there's a couple other boxes 
that people may step, that may put me out. Uh huh. Shout to the green and the ground. Uh, his people. There's a couple <laughs> people that might put me down. Hey, hey, remember? Hey, remember the first dude that I used to go at on the podcast? No. Yes, you do. He DM me out of nowhere, and it, and I felt bad. Malik? No, who? Malik, Malik Scott. Scott. He, he said, bro, you a, you a good dude, man. Oh, you good yeah. energy, bro. That's Take my up. number. Hit me anytime. That's I said, we need to delete all that. That's what's up. <laughs> but, but nah, Malik Scott there, nah, that's a good dude, man. All that's, right, so they have reached the stage. Uh, that's Is that Terrence? It I, is and it ain't. It mostly ain't. That's his entourage. Yeah. No, that's Stone Cold. Stone Cold. Oh, okay. He need to come out to the Stone Cold music, though. That makes sense. Bro. When I talk to him, I'm going to let him know. When did you slash we meet him? This dude? Stone Cold. I never met Stone Cold. You met him without me. Okay. You met Stone Cold before? You met Stone Cold before? You met Stone Cold before? No. The dude you talking about, Stone Cold. Stone Cold is, uh, come on. Hey, when I take pictures, you got to keep talking. Yeah, we, oh, yeah. So, so that we don't have no issues. I got you. We, we still waiting on Bud to get to the, but we still waiting on Bud to get to the stage. We got, uh, the highlights being played, man. This park down here is live, bro. They said 12,000 is way more than that, easily. This is the way the city supposed to show up. The sport of boxing is so small, but so big at the same time, man. And it's very, it's not hot, 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 but it's hot we out here. It. Thank you. It's hot out here a little bit, Sean. I don't say it's hot, hot. We got Mario. Mario made it down. No, no, no. I, I don't know. Marcos. I, Marcos. I've been calling him Mario forever. Yes, Marcos. And then he's right back to, where are you going tonight? He's sitting next to the champ. This is going to happen all night. This, this man is a man on a mission. Hardworking man right there, man. Shout out to Fight Hub TV, man. Hey, here's the other thing I, I learned about Omaha. I learned a lot about Omaha. We gonna we gonna really, you know, dive into I'm this aware. tomorrow on, on the podcast this week. You. But I, I learned that people know a lot about boxing you. out here. I got you. I got you. I got you. So, so you shout, shout out to Buzz people. They said because I doubted him, I gotta wear this. So this is what I'm gonna do right now. Yeah, no, it's all good. It's all good. They said it's all good. they said since I doubted him, I gotta wear this. You got a gift, huh? Yeah, I got it. No, this is. No, oh, no, 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 no. This no, no, no. Is, this Let me is, see that. This is. No, no. Man, he already that. got you one. Let me see you that. You can't have both of them. No, I want both of them. He a bully. He got a gift, y'all. He got a gift. Yeah, let's throw that out on. Let's throw that bad boy on right now. You in Omaha, boy. You in, you in Omaha, boy. There he is. There he is. Hold up, hold up, hold up. There he is. Come on, let's get it. But up here getting it. <laughs> That's clean right there, man. I'm happy for him. Stay yeah, up. man, this is this is, this is not happy about that, that highlight. Uh, you, they showed you again? Yeah, but they got a good highlight though. It's a highlight that don't really show what's happening. It just okay. show me, you know, going down. Don't really show much, you know. We got eyes on Bud. Cool. The whole city getting up there. The whole city getting up there. Yeah. Yes, sir. This is crazy, man. Yes, sir. Listen, so he ro he rode in on the boat today, and we understand what that's about. You know, he got to he got to he got to put the exclamation point on what he oh, yeah. just did. But I want to I want to make this known though, at least on the Borderway podcast, that there's no bad blood there. You know what I mean? There's it's nothing about you know what I mean. The night was the night. And I'm, and I'm going to enjoy this moment. Mm -hmm. And that means putting an exclamation point on that bad boy. Bringing the net, bringing the boat, all that kind of stuff. But at this point, he, he ain't trying to disrespect uh, He ain't trying to disrespect Earl. He just trying to enjoy his moment. You know what I mean? All so right. I want to I wanna make that known. Yeah, let you let him know what happened. You yeah, let I want to make that known. Shout out to PBC. They're in the building. Yeah, PBC we got some the... PBC here. We got some Showtime here. What, what PBC doing with this? They going to release this? This is the epilogue of the epilogue. <laughs> they got to do something with it. You know what I mean? Between social media, I'm sure yeah. this is probably Showtime uh, on, on, uh, live on YouTube. Yeah. Okay. I don't know. I don't know if Showtime has those capabilities, but Showtime Sean Porter does. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. I don't want no problem. I met Bud's, uh, one of Bud's teachers. I met his very first boxing coach. Man, I done got around this city, man, in two days. And uh, shook, some, shook, shook some important hands. We're going to get this thing started in just a second, y'all. Oh, yeah, sorry. What's up, everybody? Yeah. See you. We're going to get this thing started. Yeah. Okay, and some more boxing faces have joined Have joined in. Who you see? Who you see? Fight Hype is here. Who? Fight Hype. I ain't going to say it twice. Let's get this thing under control. I, I, I don't see him, but all right. On 14th Street, 11th Street, on 11th Street, there's a four-year-old on 11th Street. Please check your child pocket. Make sure your child is with you, please. Come on, I don't got a four-year-old. Come on, yes, you do. You got a five-year-old. I got a five-year-old. I don't got no four-year-old. We got to get in our seats. You got a four-year-old. He just, I, you can say he that. just looked 13. You can, say, you can say that. Yeah. He just in the, in the 13. This is fire. He says, quiet. Fire. You only got one? You no, know, he got another one in his backpack on the other side. Hey, DDA. DDA. These is good. Thank you. My pleasure. Yes, sir. My pleasure. Yeah, real quick. Thank you. My pleasure. Oh, we got a video. Here we go. That'll work. That'll work. Yeah. Check, check. That'll oh, work. DDA, I wasn't sure. Tell me back up. Yeah, I wasn't sure if we was on or not. Yeah, tell me back up. We good. That's crazy. You ever lost your kids? No, I ain't never lost my kids. As of yet, okay. I forgot I'm him at school one time. Oh, shit. Man, I was headed home. And then the, and then the car was just a little too quiet. <laughs> hold on, hold on. DDA? Patrice. Thank you. Oh, I got to take another one. Yeah. We need you to sing this Latrice. Yeah. Yeah, no, nah, this ain't. Oh, she going to sing too though, right? A good spiritual. Yeah. Lift every voice. Not to be okay, okay. Thank you. I'll join My sister, too. Angelique. Okay, I'm not naming Lift my daughter. Nothing every like that. Voice What's your daughter's name? And if you have one. Huh? What's your daughter's name if you have one? Till Sean Earth Field. and Heaven. Uh, no, we're naming our next one. Uh, Ring with the harmonies of living. Let our rejoicings rise high and a song full of the faith that the 
dark past has taught us. Sing a song full of the hope that the presence has brought us. Facing the right begun, let us march on till victory is won. Julie Mitchell, yeah! Live in the city right now. We're going to get this program started. I would love to bring you the stage. We got to, man. As our color guard exits. That's not how she rehearsed. That was clean. I told I told Sean, you guys, earlier. I said, Sean. Why you whispering? I think y'all have made some noise for the one and only. Hey, no, no. Michael Seville and our old child of the city. That's yes, you're supposed to keep yes. it like this. Oh, oh. Who's this? We can do better than that. Make some noise if you love Keith Crawford. All right, y'all. Check this out. Mr. Salt, bring that back. Bring that back. I'm going to set the scene real quick. All right. So, look. It's, it's fight week. It's way in. I see you, Shakur. It's way in. Bug, come out to this song. If y'all wasn't there, boy, y'all about to feel it today. Let's go. So, we're going to take them back. Mike, they gonna show you something special right now, all right? When these bars drop, Mike, oh, man. Bars, right? <laughs> hey, bud, just for you right here, Bo Mac, I see you. I'm a hog, go. See you forever. For me to you. I'ma I'm I'm need a suit. I'ma need a coop. I won't yeah. need a roof. Bye. Hey, you gotta turn this up. There you go. And we and we got to talk That's over this hey, because hey, uh, look at Dane Lawrence over there with the uh, yeah I already Shepherd. seen that. I already peeked that uh, yeah I was yeah, like I already peeked that my I look like I said okay you get yeah, 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 yeah. here we are the Let It Fly show and we are here to celebrate the consistent undefeated pound for pound best fighter in the world Mr Terrence Bud Crawford maybe you get a little argument. But the greatest athlete to ever come out of the state of Nebraska. Take him north of that The greatest athlete no, 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 to ever come true. out of the state of Nebraska. Let's go. How many of you right. were watching? And I think I can say this word, but kicked Arrow Spence's ass. How many of y'all were watching him watch his ass? Oh, yeah, I love it. Yeah. All right, let's get started. We're going to bring up your mayor. Oh, you do the video first? We're going to do that first. Video. Yeah, we're going to do that first. <laughs> All right, so check this out. We got a video that's going to show kind of like the flashback all the way to where we are today for my man Bud. So please pay attention to our video screen for this three-minute video. That's the end of it. I know, I, I know I'm confused. That's all we need right there. Yeah. Straight up. That's all we need. Showtime gave him the, the pass, too. Okay. Uh oh. Okay, okay, okay. All right, come on, Omaha. No, no, no. It's all good. We can do some beats and sheets karaoke if it ain't popping. No, oh, I'm look, all right, let's continue the festivities so we stay on time as much as we can. Hey, Yo. real, real quick. Denea, we got Anthony Jr., beautiful little fella right here. He didn't lose his mom. They just got disconnected somehow. So if you can please just come around, your child is on the stage. You got it, Mike. Go ahead. All right, let's go. Try it again. Your mayor, you couldn't my find friend, another way to Gene go. Sather. You couldn't find another way to go. Go, go? go ahead and go. Go ahead and go. Uh, uh, all right, all right, Omaha. Come on now. Come on, Omaha. Come on, Omaha. 
I'll give him your mic. Yeah, <laughs> DDSA glass and I am up there. <laughs> Good morning, there everyone. There it is. Welcome to the Gene Leahy Mall. But we are here today to recognize outstanding achievements as a world champion, as a coach, a mentor, and to the youth at BNB Sports Academy. <laughs> Your proud it. family, dedicated coaches, and faithful friends welcome you home. Yes. The city, of, the city of Omaha, your city, is pleased to honor you with this event so that everyone in Omaha can participate. And we're anxious to hear from you in just a few minutes. We have watched your career with pride every time you enter the ring and as you leave as the champion. So today we celebrate together. Throughout your career, you have set and achieved your goals. You show young athletes who look up to you the value of hard work and dedication. There you go. They learn what is possible with hard work. Yeah. Your genuine in interest in the young people of Omaha shows your real strength, is preparing the next generation for success and competition of all types. At BNB Sports Academy, you are teaching the rules of the game, good sportsmanship, teamwork, leadership, and respect for others. These life lessons are always important. Today's parade and program is possible thanks to donors who believe so strongly in you and the work that you are doing for your, your community. I want to say a special thanks to American National Bank, Baxter Auto, Liuna, the Lund Company, the Healthy Blue, Metro Transit, Swain Construction, and Willie Thiessen. Thank you all for your support. And it shows we are all on the same team, it's and necessary. that's the proper shadow behind. Yeah, yeah, I need you to block this on. But we really congratulate you, oh, and we yeah. look forward to watching too. you fight your way yeah, to the next the championship. And now it is my pleasure to introduce the governor of the state of Nebraska, Governor Jim Pillen. Listen, all right? Everybody want to talk about how short Good I am. Morning. Guess what? I have two I'm comments. I'm protected right now by the Number sun because my boy is tall and, and, and blocking the sun. So the advantages of being short, I appreciate Thank it. Thank you. Uh oh, what's the issue with this dude? Uh, it's a great, uh -oh. great day hey, why you don't like for this Omaha dude? and for the entire like state of Nebraska. Huh? Congratulations, uh -oh. Terrence Bud Cropper. You are the greatest athlete. Who is that? in the history of the state of Nebraska. Oh, okay, I guess. Second to nine. Yeah, get him on your side, sir. Get him on your side. Congratulations. Yeah. My other comment is a really simple. It don't matter if you don't believe that. Big he had time. to say it. Thank you. Thank you for all that you do. Thank you for being such an extraordinary mentor and, a, and, a, and an inspiration for all of us. A great inspiration to our kids making sure kids understand how important it is they do their best in school. Thank you for your mentorship and your leadership. And then lastly, thank you for the incredible gift of belief. All of us in Nebraska, no matter what we do, we can compete and be the best of any place in the world. Your living proof, your grit, determination, discipline, perseverance, inspires us all thank you god bless you very yeah. much yeah all right y'all booed the man he gave a great speech that was crazy they think about the hell out of that dude and next it's my privilege <laughs> to introduce y'all yeah, know States something we on crazy Omaha. we are here today to celebrate a great y'all crazy day. out here bud proper give it up they for should bud they should have great man because of his historic accomplishment. Obviously, they ain't vote for him. All his wins, 40 and 0 under history, it oh, is God. historic. No, I'm just saying, like, you know, for a memory, a memory well, or something. Well, he's not you know? just a great man because he's a great athlete, pound for pound, the best fighter in the world. He also gives back to Omaha through B&B and also pays it forward to the next generation inspiring young people everywhere. We are here today to celebrate Terrence Buffer. Bud, thanks so much for remembering Omaha. 
for embracing us, hey, for continuing to I hope us. nobody else is coming to we the stage. We love you. Thank you so much, you all you do for the city and for all the young people. God bless you, and we look forward to seeing the next thing you're going to do to make history. God bless. And with that, I'm going to bring up Don Bacon, our congressman. Oh, man. Crazy. Not only in the United States, but in the world today. We are Pell's World Series. We can go on and on, but today, we will always be known to be the home of Bud Crawford. And we are proud of it. I want to thank Bud for two things. One, he gives back to this community. He shot at baseball games. I see him. I'm out there with him. The b, &B Boxing Academy, helping yes. out so many of our youth. There's a story of him going to Pan Am games, and he gave all, way, all the clothes he had in his possession to folks in need. It shows you got a great heart, Bud. We appreciate it. Climb the ladder of success. Oh, wow. No one works harder than Bud Crawford, and today he is the best in our country, best in our world, and we want to thank you for our city. Welcome, our city council. Anita Johnson. Hey, what a beautiful day. <laughs> Bud, man, you are so incredible. You started. You know what? Perseverance, when they came, hey, you are the beacon of that. And you have definitely demonstrated that throughout our city. I need to sit down. Now to the city of Omaha, you are standing in <laughs> District 2. And hey, he said, yeah, I thank you, soft. you for you're coming so soft. today Worry about and me. representing. Give her a water It or is so fabulous because I even thought about all the kids and all the things that we can think about all down right. in the future. Hey, and you guys are definitely Who's showing right up here, and doing the oh, things that you need to do. sitting down with his legs but crossed. I'm telling you. He, he kind of did yeah. the heavy lifting for us. He did That's the heavy good. lifting. So we have a call to action today because we don't want this momentum to die. Yeah. So how can we, the people, Speak on it, Carry this on. What do we need to do? What are some action steps that we need to do to continue this momentum? We want to support local talent, education, and building to our children. Community <laughs> engagement, mentorship, promote sports and wellness to our kids. Advocate for change. Dream big. And I'm going to say that again. Dream big. Everything is possible. Bud showed us if everything is possible. And we can do it. Now it's time for us to do the work. Thank you. All right, everybody. Let's Terrell give it up McKinney. for Mr. Terrell McKinney. What's up, Omaha? Yeah. What's up, North Omaha? Let's give a big round of applause for Bud, two-time undisputed champ. Hey, bro, I just want to congratulate you for everything you do, man. It is really inspiring to see what you've become as a man, as a person, and as a friend. To see you fish fry on the 20 night was great to watch, man. I had some hot sauce, but, but it's all good. But I just want to thank you, dude, uh, for, every, for just everything. The way you give back to the community, the way you, no matter what they say about you, I you just keep that. pushing and doing what you're supposed to do. What's and that? I just want to thank you for what you did for Trent as well. He'd be very proud of you. Danita would be too. And you mad, Ant? You mad? And, uh, let me bring up down. I got connections. Chris Rogers. I, I stand up all day, baby. I'm built Couldn't for this. stand no more. Soft. Good morning. <laughs> in uh, August of 1987, oh. I came to Omaha as a student athlete at Creighton University, planning to earn a degree and have the opportunity to compete competitively at the highest level in college athletics. Little did I know that down the hill in North Omaha, a young lady by the name of Deborah would give birth to a baby boy who would write his name in Omaha, but particularly North Omaha's uh -huh. history. 
with names such as the late great Bob Gibson, the late great Bob Boozer, the late great Gail Sayers, and Nebraska's first Heisman Trophy winner, Johnny the Jet Rogers. Okay. Okay. Speaking There's a quote that says, the character of a man is not defined by what he does in front of a crowd, but instead what he does when no one is watching. Many of you watching today who don't get to see this man every day as we do in our community, yeah. you only get to see him for his boxing prowess. But you need to know hey, you the, the words of a few other people that get to see him in his everyday you life. On the line? Former city councilman Ben Gray, uh, that's a no. who sat You're on his on board of directors and who named the street after him around 33rd Laramore said, he's one of the humblest people that I know. He has an unquenchable thirst for our youth and he is giving back to our community. He said simply, Bud is like that. Another good friend of his who coached my own son in basketball named Andre Tarpley said about you, he is big on family, and he cares about his kids. He said he's one of the most competitive people I know, and he said he thought he was better in basketball than he was in boxing. <laughs> Needless to say, champ, we're glad you chose boxing. But Drake said one more thing that I think we all need to understand as I close. He said Bud understands his role and how he carries himself and how it reflects on the kids in his community. I don't know about you, but do you remember when a cable commentator told LeBron James that he needs to just shut up and dribble? After she told LeBron James that, Nike had a whole different campaign that says, I am more than an athlete. And he tried to change the way that people see athletes in their sports. But I hope you know how much we appreciate, love, and care for you. Things you want people here to know when they see you as the man. For the adults, I think he would want you to know that when you believe in a young person's potential and never give up on them, we create a foundation for their success. For young people, there's a term that says Everybody wants to go to heaven, but nobody wants to die. Pay the cost if you want to be great. For adults, the place someone comes from should never define their potential or limit their opportunities. Yeah. Okay. For you, the only easy day was yesterday. And lastly, to the adults, every young person deserves a chance to succeed regardless of their zip code. Mm. I like that. To all the young people, when someone tells you something is impossible, what they really mean is it would take more sacrifice, grit, discipline, failure, persistence than they are willing to give, but be willing to do the work. Before you leave here, you pay, you pay tribute to him with your time but I want you to pay tribute to him with your treasure. Before you leave here, you need to give something to the BNP Sports Academy. I dropped 50 myself last night. I need you to drop 10 or five, whatever's on your heart. So with that, thank you for the honor. All hail the champ. Did he just ask Bud for money, or did he? All right, did he all right, all right, all right. We got to celebrate Bud oh, a little bit. Okay, I okay, hear okay. it on TV. Can we get that chant? Crawford. Crawford. Universally recognized as the pound for pound king. The former lightweight world champion. Former undisputed super lightweight world champion. Born. That wasn't me.
Davis. I do it to him every day on the show. In brutal fashion. I'm a real fan. I don't care. Ladies and gentlemen, a big overhand right brings this bout to an end with an official time of 44 seconds of round By number five of knockout, still undefeated, Terrence Crawford. So Terrence Crawford is a guy you're going to see a lot more. <laughs> My man took off as soon as he seen the fight in. I oh, know. And they gonna skip me, right? Hell no. Hopefully, I'm, I'm hoping that the first one, when they showed, that was it. They got you out at first. Yeah. But you could be coming for a rematch. I mean, a re a replay. <laughs> replay. <laughs> You want them to skip me? Yeah, I do. But, uh, they skip me. They skip me. <laughs> no, 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 no. The video's not over yet. No, they skip me. The video's not over yet. My man had M in the building. He had M and M in the building. Good Lord. That's when I knew my money was gone. It's all right to cheer. Let's go, Omaha. Hey, so they started from the bottom, and that means we got to talk because we here, okay. and we don't want to we don't want to yeah. not be here. But well, we did start podcast. from the bottom, now we here. Yeah, why they keep doing this to us? I don't know. Yeah. That's part of the celebration. It's a good time. Nebraska came to celebrate, Sean, not to sit back. They yeah, earned but they, this. But they singing. Like, let the man get up there nah, and. No, 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 It's a, it's a have concert. You, have you ever had to accept this? Have, had to accept an award or anything? You ever been recognized for something? Yes. Yeah. Many times. You know what it feel like to sit and wait? Let's yeah, yeah, yeah. Ball. Let's go. Now stop making me wait. Yeah, Let's do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey. Are you Check a writer? Are you a writer? Gotta shout some people You're a writer. You I've come off the dome the whole with time. You know I'm he off the dome. Like you know I'm off the dome. You know I'm off the dome. You be up there stuttering. Make some noise, no, 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 my no, no, man. I'm good. I'm good. Right I'll give you an award next week. All right, good. I'm ready. I'll give you an award next hold week. On, All right, hold good. on. We hold on. We're gonna give each other awards. No, hey, real quick, just come up here. I want all to see you. Where my man Showtime Sean Porter? Where you at? Where's Showtime Sean Porter? He. There you go. Hey, look, 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 look. We Doing just want to make some noise for y'all coming to Omaha. <laughs> we appreciate you, Secure. We just want to recognize you. You next, fam. That's my word. Yeah. One more time. Let's go. I'm going to think I'm going to go up. All right. We know how big of a star Bud is in they Omaha, how big he is in Nebraska. But he's worldwide. You're going to know this from the next video coming up. We've got video from Clarissa Shields, the first woman to win in two different divisions. Damien Lillard. You'll hear from him. Don Tripp. Rick Ross. Russell Westbrook. Shakur Stevenson, Shaq, Papoose, E40, and LL Cool J. Hear them give Come a shout Come on, let's go. Why you ended with LL like LL was the biggest name you said? LL the Terrence guy. Bud Crawford, excuse me, Chad. This is Shaq. I want to say congratulations to I you. I want to say congratulations to you. Your lovely wife, uh, your kids, and kids. the rest of your family. You've always been the best. Is that a good time? You still are the best. You're the guy. You will go down as the greatest of all time. I'm grace. proud to say I'm a, I am a fan. I'm a big fan. I love you. I love you. The place you're at right now, everybody loves you. Everybody's screaming your name. Yeah. Only got to say one thing, brother. Congratulations. You deserve it. Love you, champ. Make some noise for the champ. Congratulations, yeah. bud.
I want to say that I appreciate you. I appreciate everything you've done for my career since I started, uh, since I became a professional. Um, it was a hell of a performance you put on Aerospace. Um, I'm proud of you. Um, like I said, from the beginning of my career, uh, you've done nothing but help me. And honestly, I done looked up to a lot of people and they let me down because they don't wear their flaws on their sleeve. But um, you somebody who wear, wear their flaws on their sleeve and you still is a, a great role model and a great person. So I want to tell you, I appreciate you and I want to give you your flowers. Um, you mean a lot to me, big bro. Well, what's up, brother? Just want to congratulate you um, on all your success. Uh, continue. It's the biggest boss in the game, Ricky Rose, and it's only one way to do this. The biggest. Terrence Crawford, Team Crawford, you did the unthinkable. The underdog, you made the world watch. Four belts, it's never been done, homie. We salute you, you know I love you. I'm always on your team, I always got your back. Crawford, bam. Yo, bud, congratulations on a victory well deserved. I've been arguing with these dudes for years, telling them you was the truth. They had to learn the hard way, but listen, man, keep going, stay focused. Family first, real people do real things, no excuses. Congrats, bud. Salute. Hey, Terrence, what's happening? It's your boy E40, man. I just want to say congratulations, congratulations on your huge win over Errol Spence and becoming an undisputed welterweight champion of the world. You made history, baby on Box's biggest stage. Enjoy your celebration today, man. You and your family, friends, fans, hometown, Omaha, Nebraska. Love you, brother. What can I say? Shout out to the two-time undisputed champion of the world, Terrence. Yo, I'm so proud of you to be able to watch your journey to see how hardworking you are, to see how you never let anything um, discourage you from getting to that point. How you went out there and your performance and your domination. I want to tell you congrats from the quote. And I wish you much more success, man. And uh, once again, you are my pound for pound number one. And uh, nobody can tell me no different. Congrats. Yeah. Like Champ. From Tennessee all the way to Nebraska. You know how we rocking. I just wanted to send my, my, my love and my support, man. Congratulations on the win. And again, man, you know how we rocking. It's always love. Yeah. <laughs> Clean. Mr. Terrence Bud Crawford, I just wanted to take a second to say congratulations to you, bro. You know what I'm saying? You know, I ain't one of these new fans. I ain't one of these people that just, you know what I'm saying? When your name start picking up steam, even in the last couple weeks, you know what I'm saying? You done became about 50% more famous. You know what I mean? And, uh, you know, I've been around a long time, bro. I called the stoppage. You know what I'm saying? I, I always been a major fan, and not just you as a fighter, but you as a man, bro. So much respect to you. Congratulations. Uh, and I'm happy to see you getting the flowers that you deserve, man. We need more people that represent and carry themselves like you, man, as a father, as a husband, and as a professional. Much love to you, bro. Peace. Yo, Bud, man, congratulations. You know what I'm saying? Mr. Crawford, you did what you had to do. You're the undisputed welterweight champion of the world. You went in there. You put on a showcase, a masterpiece, a boxing clinic, and the whole world saw it, and we respect you for it, man. And I just want to say congratulations to you, to your team, to your family. You represent your city well. You represent your family well, and you did what you had to do. Now, little kids, all the little kids at the gym can look at you and dream about all the things that they can do and all the dreams they can make come true. So congratulations again, champ. I wish you all the best. Shout out to the whole Omaha, Nebraska. I love you, man. Peace, champ. Mic check. There you go. All right, man. Start a roast <laughs> session up here. No, I'm playing. Hey, real quick, I want to give a special shout out to um, Christy Anderson and uh, Michaela McMorris from Moxie 16. <laughs> Sincerely, this is beautiful. I'm going to appreciate you. Thank you. you. You know, you've heard the story of Terrence Crawford a lot today and over the last couple of weeks since the fight. We don't talk enough about Team Crawford. I had a chance to talk to Red Spikes a couple weeks before the fight. And he talked to all the people who doubted. He talked to every one of them, and he said, you know what? Delete your account. 
<laughs> because after this fight's over, they'll have nothing to say. Everybody he's fought, oh, over the hill, these guys weren't any good, whatever else. And he took care of business, and Team Crawford got him there. They're very special. Team Crawford's made of trainers and coaches who know how to create world champions. All right, so let's hear from Team Crawford. I like that. Let's hear from Team Crawford. Let's make some noise. Yeah. All right. Let's bring him up proper. He is the current NABA champion. 19 wins, 15 knockouts, zero losses. He is the executive director of BNB Sports Academy. Ladies and gentlemen, bring up my man. He stayed close on the so Hey, am yeah, I good? Yeah, 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 you got me right. in? Yeah, I got you. Okay, my I don't got music. you. That's my ears. theme music. That's better. But, um, yeah, tell me about my earphones. Go. I first, I want to yeah, give a, like uh, every organization, every individual that was part of the parade, because they put on an amazing show, as you guys can see. Yeah. So give a round of applause to the members of the parade. Yeah. Next, I want to um, thank every volunteer, every staff, you know, we sat down together almost every day for the past almost two weeks to make sure this was success. Uh, we got everything down to the T, even my time up here on the stage, which I'm going to exceed. <laughs> it's so much to talk about when it comes to Terrence, Bud Crawford. Um, you know, wow, man, this is amazing. This is amazing. It really is. To see all you people come out. Um, I don't like to say the word I can't believe because since the beginning of his career and my career, we've always talked about these moments. He's always dreamed about these moments. And, you know, we spoke them into existence, you know, and, you know, every time we back there and we working out and we're back in the back, back room, locker room, we're looking at each other and we're, we say, hey, you swing, I swing. Bro, you start the show, and I'm going to finish the show. And, you know, we live by that, you know, every day. You know, growing up with Bud, and we don't have a pro NFL team here. We don't have a pro NBA team here. But we do have, we have Terrence, Bud, Crawford. So it's a... It's amazing for me to travel this world, you know, and be proud, be proud of him and brag about that. Like, I'm part of Team Crawford, you know. Yeah. Everybody know it's Team Nelson. It's, yeah. You know, we have a lot of great members of Team Crawford, but it's amazing to be able to be, say, I'm proud of him. As a friend, as a brother, as a colleague, and as a teammate. And for the people who don't know how it is growing up in North Omaha, you know, in the area we grew up, I can't speak for everybody, but the people we grew up with, the guys who were flashy, had the cars, had all the attention, you know, those guys weren't living a positive life. So as kids, you know what we're going to do? We're going to follow behind them and do the same thing. But this man right here, oh, man. he's changed you, you the scope of that. You know, he gave the kids hope. And he's humble. He comes oh down well. to the gym every day. And he trains That's next to you these kids. Oh well. Trains them. You know, does things <laughs> off record by picking them up and, and doing that. things for their family. So we got to celebrate that. But not only celebrate that, we got to keep that train rolling. You know, right and that's why I always promote give back, give back, give back. Could a weight on this man back is heavy. So it takes a village, right? It takes a village, right? So we all have to chip in and help out because we have the potential of doing big things, you know, through what this, this man has opened up and the doors he's opened for us. Got to keep that train rolling. And no, I'm not always you, asking you for financial contributions. There's so many ways you can get back it. to these kids. <laughs> Volunteering. You know, sure. everybody have, has a different expertise. You can always contact me. It's not hard to get a hold of me. And we can set things up and show these kids new things that they can be the next 
Terrence, Bud Crawford. And it doesn't have to be just in boxing. There's a thousand other things these kids can do. So it's up to us, the adults, the leaders in this community, to do that and give back to these kids. And that's all I ask for you guys to do is show, show these kids the way, open up doorways for them, and keep doing what this man, Bud, is doing. No matter what adversity he has faced, he's always came on the top. You know, I tell people, there's nobody I've ever met that's more competitive than this man. And not only competitive with other people, competitive with himself. He pushes himself every time he reaches a plateau, no. he pushes himself farther and farther and farther and work harder and harder and harder. And these kids have hope when they look at him doing it right next to him because he's that humble to be next to the community. I know all you guys have seen Bud, the gas station at the YMCA, and everywhere around. You know, he don't have to walk around they with an entourage and security every day. You know, he's humble enough to do that. If that was me, you would be so like, we're going to all keep yeah, yeah. leading 100. the way. And I have a couple members up here from my gym who can share the same things I'm saying up here. Um, Tierra, Jason, um, and Z. You guys want to step up and talk to the crowd? Oh, wow. Bring up Bomac. Bring up Bomac. Yeah. Bring up Bomac. Yeah. Come on, Bomac. Okay. Come on, Bomac. We come, come up. Come on, right Bomac. Here. I want the kids to come up that's as well. Yeah. Come up with that's, you. That's what you kids, would do. Come up. Skip it. Come you, up with Yeah. What in the No, y'all better bring Bomac up properly. Uh, again, Let's go. Respect. Bring Bomac. Bring him with you. Bring him with you. There you go. Hey, that boy, Bomac. I seen some pictures of that young man. Okay, I'm on. That young man. In shape? That boy was in shape. He ain't new to this. Yeah. Oh, wow, you say you had a bad heart, huh? Yeah, wow. The things you don't know. What's up, Omaha? We did it, didn't we? Yes! Yes, sir. F follow my lead. Work time. 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 All right, y'all. Listen. I, I wanted to bring this little kid up here. This is my rock right here. This is my, my everyday guy that texts me every single day. Papa, when you coming home? Papa, what you doing? Papa, where Bud at? Papa, where Steve at? Dude, stop calling me. Stop texting me. Dude, I'm working. Papa, can you send me some money on Cash App? Papa, <laughs> this is Malachi, y'all. What this up, Malachi? Right <laughs> Listen, listen, you know I can't do this by myself. And you know I'm gonna bring my team up here. Come on, Red. Come on, Red. That's Come red. on, Red. Oh, it's Red. That's Red. Come on, Toe. Get your ass up. They, just, they messed up and gave me the mic. Let's go, Chet. Let's go, Chet. Let's go, Ashley. Let's go. Let's. We're, uh, we're, uh, Julie, Julie. I got my copy. Come on. We're Jessica at. Well, I got a team for real. He gonna call Bernie Let's go. Oh, this is, okay, this okay. is Team Crawford. This team makes shit happen every single day. This is Team Dr. Conroy, where you at? Shit the cup man. Where day. Alan? That was your problem. Let's go. You have a team. Let's no, go, no, Doc. Daddy was seven hey, of those people. People, Slow people down. think, people think, <laughs> and you people think because <laughs> we got this old white man in the corner, he don't know what he's doing, but this is the best doctor out here. What are you talking about? Oh, oh, my, I'm like, if, if my knee, oh, if my knee hurt, who I call? I call Doc. One of those. Doc, can't get some stretching. Doc, can you help me out? Doc, can you come look at my knee? He come all the way up to Colorado Springs and check us out. Y'all know I can't forget. Bernie the Boxer! Where Bernie the Boxer at? There he go, right here. Here's Bernie the Boxer right here. Hey, hey, this man, this man keep it going in, the, in camp. This man, he talk all day long. Hey, we get up for breakfast, Bernie talking. Bernie, Bernie's a good dude. <laughs> Bernie's yeah, Bernie's a good I realize. Dude. We have a couple yeah, members yeah. that couldn't make it out. Uh, Paulina with Perfecting a um, Athletes. We have uh, Alan, the nutritionist. Are you yeah, I know. Good that is me. Oh, uh, he already up here. Okay, 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 we good. Yeah. So uh, perfecting athletes are um, a big part of our camp as well. Yeah, make sure we eat right, 
you know, we rehydrated right and everything as well. They're not here in town, so y'all forget anybody on Team Crawford? I forget anybody? I, I gotta I gotta give a shout out to my, my best friend, one of my best friends, Tim Dow. What's up, Tim? Stand up, Tim. Stand up. I've been knowing this dude since I've been eight years old. He always say, Bo, I got your back. Bo, I got your back. But I want to say this. Let me get a shout out to my barber. Nah, what's up, baby? My barber. I want to say this. My man, look, 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 look. He taking all you of know, it, he, too. I had to say Don, or he, he, gonna, he ain't going to cut my hair no more. I got to say this. Come on, y'all. Come on. Come on. I appreciate you, man. That's good. That's Thank good. You. That's good. That's I good. told you. That's good. I told you. I told you we was going to do it. That's good. I told you. I said this to Bud one day. I said, man, we're going to ride your back till the wheels fall off. He said, man, what are we going to call it? What are we going to call it? We're going to call it B&B. He said, what? Yeah, go down. What? What? Wait a minute. What is B&B? I said, man, you, Bud. Remember that? 2000. Almost took him. Eight, nine or something like that. My man, I appreciate you, man. I'm proud of Sold you, bro. Yeah, that is going for 10 piece, too. You're going to show the best fighter in the world is. Hey, we're going to bring, hey, Bo Max, we're going to bring the mayor up, and she's going to give you guys some trophies that we have for you. Real quick, Reds want to say something real quick. Rex Spike. Anybody, anybody want to hit my rap? Hey. No, ain't nobody rapping. Oh. Hey, if y'all watch the old fights, uh, what, we, what we do is recognize we number one in the world. We number one in the coaches. We all stand like this. So I want to do a selfie real quick. One finger up. Get your finger on my face. Mayor's going <laughs> to. Okay. We're going to start off with the conditioning coach. Ashley Richard first. I just want to know. What, 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 I'm not Russ. Yeah, it's organized. What, then you just look at me and say, y'all, it's, it's been a long time coming. Yeah, so, yeah, enjoy the moment. That right, and right Bo Mack mentioned him. He's that the guy you yeah, call when your knee hurt. Don't Team doctor, Brian Conroy. Yeah, yeah. Next is my guy, Mr. Bernie. The boxer, <laughs> Davis. <laughs> No, 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 I'm good. Yeah, that's all right right there, <laughs> ain't it? Yeah, that's cool. That doesn't work. I'll, I'll, I'll take one of them. Hey, no, I love him because no, 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 he's no, going to no, be no, the no, same no, no, no matter no, where no. he go. <laughs> Respect, bro. He don't Another of the what's assistant up, coaches. S.A. Diggins. All, all of a sudden, you want to sit down, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, sir. Sure, yeah, sure. Saul. Oh, man. Yeah, yeah, Jesus, look at you. This is tight. Yeah, big ass. Next is one of the most humble people I know. I'm so tight. My man, Mr. Red Spikes. Why is yours on mine? Oh, man. Oh, man, let's do the show now. <laughs> and last but certainly not least, Brian Bomack McIntyre. Bomack been in boxing for a long time. Yeah. And, and people don't know that about him, you know, and obviously you, you judge a book by his cover. Well, we just, uh, All right, we're going to get them back to their seats happened? and continue so we can bring up the man you're here for. Thanks, Red. Appreciate it. Good woman. All right, let's get started. As Steven mentioned, the b, b Sports Academy serves about 150 youth in the community, teaching them not just about boxing, yeah. but about life as well. Yeah, b, b currently has a waiting list and need support to help support these kids. If you'd like to give b, &B Sports Academy and help the kids, yeah. the QR code that we have around, we'll have it up on the screen as well. You can always just go to bnbacademy.org. As we said earlier, Chris Rogers said, whether it's $5, $10, whatever you can give, the kids can use your help. I will also first like to recognize Miss Precious McKesson and my guy, Gerald Coon, I ain't forgot about my people. Don't worry about that. I got y'all. All right. And also, now we'd like to look at our generous, our, our QR code up here. Tap into that for sure. Get your phones out. 
And we like to thank our generous sponsors. I met a few earlier for supporting this event. Can I, can I thank you guys for doing that. All right, let me set here, this bro. fluff down real quick. Donate for me. And now yeah, before we get into honoring, come up here. Come up here with me, Mike, please. Come I up also here. want to recognize the B&B Sports Academy board members. If you're on the board, can you please stand up so we can recognize yeah, you? Yeah, we're the board you're members. On the board, at. stand up, please, so we can recognize you. There you go, my man Chris. Thank you very much for Chris what you Hill. do. We appreciate it. Thank you very much. There you go. All right, hey, I now check like this out. Now, before uh, we introduce the champ, I was just thinking about something or whatever, all right? More music. Um, Here we have go. you ever had a, like, you know it was overweight win moment? Sure, yeah, definitely. All right, so check this out. So I'm getting ready for the fight. I'm at the house. My wife, my family, I got my cocktail in my hand. I'm feeling good. And then all of a sudden, Spence come out and he do his ring walk and all that. And I'm like, oh, okay, that's cool. But then, you know it was over when you heard this. Yeah, so. We, I ain't gonna front. When that hit, oh, that was different. That was different. Listen, cause I, I do. I think that Tyson, that I've seen, Tyson Fury has had some of the best walk, ring walks. Uh, you know, and for Bud to just walk to the ring with Eminem, there was something different about that. I just didn't. That joint was all the way on a whole nother level. And nobody knew what song it was gonna be, none of that, you know what I mean? So that just that moment was so respectful. You know, so much respect to that moment. How, how was it and in the building in that moment? Crazy. Crazy. But first time I ever uh, recorded two ring walks. First time ever. I, and of course I was doing some stuff for, yeah, for uh, GQ. GQ Sports. But after the moment, like I realized that yo, I got some gold in my hand, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Is it me? All right, so I just put a port away podcast. They're like, we already seen this. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, cool. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you know him well from Omaha. I don't know him. Nebraska. No, Omaha. Let's go, get loud. Omaha, get loud. Took two times. Unify the title. That ain't loud enough. 40 yeah. and 0. No loss. No tie. But 40 and 0. And the other one to go to pound. Go ahead, 40 and 0. Undisputed, undefeated. There he is. The way champion of the world. There he is. Yeah. I make face last night. Yeah, that's everybody. Yeah. How the hell they know I got beaten? Hey, that's they was following me. Oh, oh, wait, repost on the four way podcast. No, I don't like him no more. I'm make some noise. That's crazy. Wow, 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 wow. That song hit hard. That song really hit hard. So with that being said, I got to give an honor to God. Got to thank him. Got to always thank him. Because without God. him, none of this would be possible. You know? And what Jeezy said, I used to have nothing. I feel that in my heart, in my soul. I remember being 12 years old in the streets, running up Aim Street from my grandma's house, you know, trying to get it, you know, and people, bud, bud, you know, I'm just like, man, I'm gonna make it. Ain't no way, ain't nothing gonna stop me from making it. Yeah, I was bad, I was in the, in the streets, with all the knuckleheads, but I still 
kept my mind on my ultimate goal, and that was become a world champion. Yes, sir. I always felt as if I was a leader, and I was put in the place that I am right now to lead. Yeah. All my friends, all my peers, all my family members, all of them drunk, all of them smoked, all of them liked the party. I was the only one out of everybody that never drunk, never smoked. I was high off of life. <laughs> I gotta thank Bernard. I gotta thank Bernard and I gotta thank Rosendo. If none of y'all know, Rosendo is an individual that was boxing grow growing up with me that really got me back in the sport of boxing. Him and Bernard. Every time I see Bernard. Rosendo, my boy right there. Rosendo. I tell him this all the time. I don't know if I would have came back if it wasn't for them. You know, and I love him. Yes, sir. Man, to see everybody out here to support me. A little kid from Omaha. Man. No kid from Omaha. Overachiever. I always say I'm an overachiever because my dream was just to win one title. And now I'm on top of round my rush worship where I'm <laughs> <laughs> Take your time, bud. I just want everybody to know I appreciate all y'all for coming out here to support me, my team. And like I always said, it's not just me winning. We all winning together. When they say Omaha, we always looked over. You know, let's get back to the old Nebraska days when we was a big powerhouse. We can do that. And I always say it's possible. No matter where we go, no matter what we do, no matter who, uh, who we up against, it's possible. It's always possible. With hard work, dedication, and belief, anything is possible. And I'm a living testimony to that. A lot of people told me I wasn't going to become nothing. Look where I'm at. <laughs> if if y'all know me and y'all know the real Terrence Crawford, which a lot of y'all do, None of y'all thought I was going to grow up to be this guy that y'all standing in front of. Y'all say, boy, you was a little bad, little boy running around this mug. Now you speak so, so nice. You, you giving back to the community. You re represent us well. And half of y'all thought I was going to be dead or in jail. But, you know, I'm glad I turned my life around for the best. Amen. Amen. And, yes, and, and like I say, it ain't how you start the race. It's always how you finish it. There you go. Thank you. I love y'all. Hey, bud, bud, before you go. Wait, hold on, hold hey, on. Hey, bud, before Wait, you go, before we got you go. for you, bro. We got a special, we got a special surprise for you. Bring up, bring up Mayor Gene Stoppard. We got a yeah, special we got surprise. A surprise. Oh, and one, one more thing, yeah. one more thing. You know, a lot of people... You know, probably know me for playing basketball, like they said, Tarp said. He glad that I picked up basketball. Josh played for the Creighton Blue Jays. D1. D1, Josh Jones. Mr. D1. One-on-one, on one, Tennis Crawford beat him. I know, I knew that. Okay. And okay. Of, and a lot of other people's in the crowd, too. They don't want to give my credit. All right, we got a special announcement, all right? This is, this is huge. Are you ready for this? All right. Wait, wait, wait. All right, Miss. Go, go. go ahead, Mayor. All right, one more surprise for Bud. Bud, we know that your dream is to help more young people participate in B&B Sports Academy, but we know your gym is running out of room, so we would like to help you build on your success. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. 
Oh, man. North of your academy. So with city council approval, and I think I'll get that, we're going to offer to sell oh, you this land this for the bargain sell, price sell, of $1. Sell, sell. Oh! Okay, okay. <laughs> okay. Anyway, what's okay. See, see, offer you to sell to for $1. Oh, wow. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Give it up for that, yeah. Oh, wow. You see how God works? When you put them first, you see how God work when you put them first? Okay, so everybody, everybody. So you see how the city supported us with this? I want each and every one of y'all, if y'all can, the, the kids up here that y'all see before y'all, it's a boxing event at the Butler Gas YMCA. I know it ain't too big. I know everybody ain't gonna make it, but if you can, can you please show up, show support, you know what I mean? And give these kids some warm, open, and welcome. Yeah, right not just not just the kids from our gym. It's going to be kids from all over. And just show support and then watch the talent that we talking about. Because they doing this to, to reach a level I'm gonna make great. of Terrence Crawford. And I wouldn't want y'all to wait till they get to a point where I am, I am right now to support them. Support them right now. And then later on tonight, for all the adults, at the steel room, we having a party. We turning up. Turn up. Steel house. Hey. All right, hey, real quick for everybody with a camera, let's make space so Bud can get in there with the mayor. Moxie 16, please. Uh, crazy, Christy, get in there for crazy. a picture, please. And whomever hey, hey, else, hey, Bud, Turbo you like, Mark, uh, we got to get a picture for Thank you. Thank you. Just, I want to go over them. So, I, and over this music. I want to sure we go over this music, too. So, that right there, yeah, like, that that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Like that's another oh, that's another oh, belt right there. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's another big yeah, win. Yeah, Sean, that's the biggest you know? one. Yeah. This and is what the quarter box is always me, like, needed. Everybody say it shouldn't take him doing all this for them to do that for him. He's been a champion for a long time. That's what everybody in Omaha been saying. And I've been trying to tell people like timing is everything. Yes. It ain't just a matter of him becoming champion. It's yeah. a matter of that timing being something that everybody feels, hey, this is what we can do now. Yeah. They can do this now, man. And for them to sell him that 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 uh land for one dollar. One dollar. That was some of the sexiest, that's the sexiest that, thing that, I'm gonna hear today. That was blessing. If, if I don't talk to my wife today, you know, that's the sexiest thing I'm gonna hear today. And, and the same thing you said, everything's about timing. And I said the same somebody, pray for somebody. I said the same thing as Getting it to, oh, oh, top thank you. Yeah. Yeah. It was all about timing. Yeah. And now he's a prize fighter. Yeah. For here on, he'll yeah. make miss, big fights and everything. Yeah. And, and that's what it's all about, man, for him. To... <laughs> that's what everybody say. Yes, sir. Appreciate it. For him to make this happen, man, for the city, bring the city together. I've seen the security running around a little bit, but it wasn't too crazy, you know what I mean? And uh, a couple couple people lost their family, their, their kids. But it looked like everybody coming around. It looked it look like everybody coming around. Things is coming coming back how it's supposed to be. Yes, sir. Pleasure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, ma'am. We was at Mama What's his name? Anthony. Ant Anthony. You go by Anthony in public yeah. or you go by Ant with two T's in public? Two T's. This two T's. Ant. My name's Anthony. I look like who? Oh, no, no, that ain't me, that ain't me, right, so, that ain't me, that ain't me. Hey, so now that this is over, you know it's going to be picture after picture for me. Yes, sir, yeah, good to see you. It's going to be picture after picture gonna, for me. Crazy. So, um, we got two two options in my in my book. Well, we can't rush out of here because even if we leave, the traffic. Well, there's nowhere to go. I can rush to the car. And just sit in the car? And just sit in the car. Yeah, I can, you know I got the keys. I got the keys just in case something went down. I had to make sure I had the keys. What about anybody else? Out. I don't play. We doing it right now. Oh, yeah. yeah. It. Appreciate <laughs> it, man. Yeah. Thank you, baby. Pull your phone out. We on right now. <laughs> no, no. Yeah. What you guys say on the podcast? Yeah. What you think about Bud? For all the stuff that he got going on. He the most humblest guy that I know that got this type of fame. You can see him out in the community everywhere, man. He more he humble than me? Man, you good too, but he <laughs> might. Hey, 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 I see him all the time. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hey, yes, but, but you good too, man. Yeah, man. I love your Let shit, though, bro. This. I appreciate that, man. We doing it right now. I appreciate it, big dog. Yeah, we on the show. So maybe after that. I'm running out of here after the show, though.
Yes, sir. Yo, we get Good to meet you, man. I'll be back. Yeah, I'll be back. Don't be going against Bud no more. Hey, ne never again. Never. Get your phone out. Get your phone out. Put your phone out for what? You ain't in the picture. You do the show. Oh, okay. I'm getting a picture from my man. My man need a picture. Uh, yeah, yeah, I got you. What I you mean you ain't get it? Because of the sun. If you have lost your daughter, we Take care, boss. All right, all right, I got you, I got you, I got you. I told you, I fuck with y'all. My pleasure, my pleasure. Hey, take a picture. Take a picture for us. I fuck with y'all, man, for real. With a purple T-shirt and a tank top over it. Taking no picture of you. Yeah. Good to meet you, sir. Good to meet you. All right, let's wrap this. Let's yeah, wrap yeah, let's this. wrap this up. Yeah. Man, this is, <laughs> oh, man. Let's this, wrap this. This, is, this has been an amazing time, um, man. Would you say we got what we came for? Oh, heck yeah. I almost said hell yeah. But I'm going to keep it respectful. It was, it was a got, hell of an event. I got a little bit more than what I came for. Sean got, was very uh got two happy. L's on my I got two L's on my on my record. Yeah. In spades. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So. Hey, yeah. Uh, hey, hey. He's sweating like hey, he's been doing something. Yeah. Hey Sean, how good of a partner is he? Yeah, my this is my guy. It's my guy. Well y'all didn't win nothing, so how good uh, are you? Uh, Who, yeah. Who's the weak link? Listen. No, 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 first of all. Listen. Oh, uh, uh, Malcolm. Don't do that. Don't do that. They do. They you don't. play big joker. No, no, no. That you that's how that's how children play. So stop. Just back up. Just back up. You okay. just embarrassed yourself. No. Now he listen. He's from Albany. I've New never York, seen this not the thing. New York, New York. I've New never York. seen him. I've never seen him I'm, win a I'm game of spades. And, well, so I think it's on him. Three times Monopoly at your own house. Why y'all talking, talking about spades? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, we talking about spades. You like? Let me get it. Listen, we'll be. Uh, we got the podcast coming to y'all Tuesday. Happy to be here in Omaha, Nebraska, with Bud, his family. Friends, uh, the city has been amazing out here, man. Happy to be able to do this. And I want to go on record for saying, if you've never been to Omaha, Nebraska, you need to come. It ain't what you think it is. You need to come. Um, for y'all who've been going to the islands and all that kind of stuff, it's cool. It's great. I, I love the islands too. Okay, okay, but, okay. But no, no, no. Because okay. what I'm saying is, okay. what I'm saying I'm, is, I'll go to the island. And I'm not saying. But if you get a chance, stop in Omaha. Not okay. saying, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, I, uh, yeah. I love Omaha, but yeah. let's be real. Uh, Can I say what I was saying? Yeah, all right, go ahead. Is it, did I mess it up? Yeah, yeah, because yeah, Marcos just, knew that was some BS. I'm just saying, like, you overlook. There's a lot of places you overlook, you know? And yeah, 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 yeah. Omaha's yeah. been overlooked. That's okay, all uh, don't compare it to an island. No, I wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> that's, a, that's a lot. I mean, <laughs> okay, you yeah, already don't like me here. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. But you know, it's, look, it's look, a great place. Though. Great, great people. Yeah. Um, I think, yeah, yeah. The, and let's be real. I think the people are starving for other people to recognize yes. Omaha. They're starving for people to recognize They're tired of being overlooked. Nebraska. And and you honestly though, you will have to come here and get a good taste of New York. Uh, uh, get a good taste of Omaha. I said, uh, and, and DDA, our producer, he said Omaha's a lot like the Midwest and the South mixed. Yeah. You know, so you get the hospitality of the South. But you also you still get a, a little bit of the city that you would get from you know Midwest like Cleveland, Akron, stuff like that. All that being said, I'm not man, gonna lie, y'all missed. That. If you're not here today, you missed one. Yeah. This this was special, man. Yeah. This was. Well, that's this why was we brought the, the podcast. City. Here. I know, but you know? the why feeling. We, we I, it to hey, them. shout out to everybody yeah. watching. But if you yeah. was here, yeah. Woo! Yeah. The energy, man. Yeah. It just went back forever. You couldn't even see the end of this. I'm coming back, and I'm not. Okay. I'm not coming back. Uh, I'm coming back to tell this story. Okay. There's uh there's some stories here that need to be told, and um you know I think that that will help uh the city of Omaha in terms of them feeling like oh we don't get the credit we deserve. Show Showtime Sean Porter is gonna come down here and make okay. sure I, uh -oh. I expose uh -oh. this city and expose uh the plentiful okay. uh, uh uh nature of boxing that's down here for the sake of words. So looking forward to coming back, man, and thank you to Omaha, Nebraska for opening up the doors to. Myself to the podcast to yeah. to two T's right here, yeah. and uh, we we'll see you on the podcast, man. Yeah. This is the Porter. Food's been great. <laughs>